We're live at Newsom Stadium in Nashville, home of the Lycans, where country music started. A uh, bit of trivia for you, Grim. Nashville has the lowest number of teeth per person. Whatever. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Los Scandalous Volts take on the Nashville Lycans. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> see that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it because I'm too fast. <laughs> It's a beautiful day for MFL football, at least in the booth with the AC, personal servants, and blood shield. Hi, Grim Blitzer here with you, along with my partner, Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. How are you guys doing? I'm doing that little hottie who works in deep fry at the concessions. He said how, not who, you idiot, even if you got the answer right. And it's first and ten. <laughs> which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. First down! I see this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. And it's first and ten. Nice run there for eight yards. Second down and two. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. Don't worry. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. The 20. That was just another day at the office for this guy. Uh, you know, he killed his boss at his old job. That's why they drafted him. You think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. And they line up for the extra point. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, that's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant meat. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. Maybe the QB should throw it and catch it too. Third down and five. And it's first and ten. 
And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. Second down and six. Third down and, well, good luck. First and ten. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. First down and three. Well, it looks like he wanted to run before he caught it. You gotta keep your eye on the ball. Come on, you dirtbag. You gotta make that catch. Second and three. <laughs> Pow! With the brain scrambler! Third and two. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Grim. It's good. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a... One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grass waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Stepping up their game, Bricks. He just stepped up and blew up. <laughs> He's got a lot of guts, doesn't he? And you can see the ground crew cleaning him up now. Hot potato gets him every time. And it's first and ten. And then Cats will give them a first down. First and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and ten. down and long. Oh, man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a rocket, and they'll keep the drive alive as he rifles it in there and picks up seven yards. Thank God he's still got his leg. He's going to need all of it for this kick. For it. And if you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know, I hate those zebra men.
I thought the only tie we'd see would be a noose. Instead, they're in a dead heat. Tie game at the end of one. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Don't do anything stupid here. Just punt the damn ball and play defense. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. And he's got a throw, oh, and he just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. Man, he shoveled his feet so well on that play. He should go to lost wages and deal cards. First down. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Third down and three. The defense better look out. The offense called the beast boost dirty trick. Hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits the airport men's room. Good and hard. First down. And it's first and ten. Pow with the brain scrambler. Second down and two. Pick up the first down with a nice piece of running there. And it's first and ten. No, oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grin. You're right. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. <laughs> and here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Screw that up. No one died. Bombs don't kill mutants, Grim. Mutants kill mutants. Second down and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. Third and four. He was 
not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. It's two-yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. That's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And that's just a great run for a touchdown. And that, my friend, is the dance with someone who knows they can negotiate for more money next year. I call that shake, rattle, and bone. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. Straight through the uprights. When you get knocked down, you gotta get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. First down! This guy just loves to hit people as hard as he can, Grim. I don't even think... And they take their first time out. Well, how predictable. Surprise us next time. Call the time out there in halftime. And it's first and ten. Well, of course, he, he could have had an interception, returned it for a touchdown and changed the entire game, but I don't want to nitpick. The receiver makes a grab for five yards. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil and beer? The teams come out of halftime all tied up and ready to battle it out. Oh, geez, Grim, I hope someone ties them soon. They gotta play football. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! And it's first and ten. Way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful.
And it's first and ten. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Second down and two. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Third and two. If you don't hear it coming, it'll knock you right on your ass. It's called a... And he just wrestles away from that tackle. Holy crap, he runs straight into a mutant trap and dies. Reminds me of my breakfast cereal, the old nut crunch. Here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five on that play. Second down and five. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Nice pickup for six yards. Third down and six. Man, guys like a freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. Second down and a lot. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And it's first and ten. It's a zap attack. Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji. The new game from Wilton Crabtree. He's at the 40. The 30. He's at the 20. The 10. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. First and ten. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Second down and ten. That's a nice gain of about seven yards on that run.
Third down and three. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And it's first and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. He just got crushed. And it's first and ten. He took a beast boost injection. Now wants him stomp all over his opponents. I want to take a beast boost injection too. And now that is weird side effects, Bricks. Just follow the bloody footprints to the new line. That's a first down. <laughs> first down and three. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. First down and three. And that's a sack. Speaking of sacks, has anybody seen my powder? I'm itching like crazy over here. Hey, man, I was going to get him now. You know what happened? Second and three. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. It's good. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my off season. And it's first and ten. <laughs> oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get hit hard and have the ball knocked loose. And it's first and ten. And the defense falls for that trick all the time. <laughs> now they're mopping the players off the field. Literally. Second down and ten. in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. And that is caught for a first down. First down and one. And that'll be 
be second down and four. Perfect pass and the score! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> I kind of feel sorry for him. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And it's first and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. Third down and nine. here or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room it goes right through yeah like a double stuffed burrito from taco hell here comes the kickoff let's see if the defense can hold them he sets up for the return let's see if he can break one wide open oh it's a punishing hit First and ten. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. Man, he's running like a bull on steroids. That'll be a first down. And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bear boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. It oh! You ever do that again, Bricks? I'll shoot you in the head. But well, people like it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Slipped away like a greased pig. That, my 
my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit. And it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. They stunt the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Grim. Four yards on that one, and he was just starting to pick up some speed. Hey, Grim, I know a guy if that's what you're after. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. And that'll bring up third and one. somehow and hold on for the first down this guy has a nice set of hands and they are out of timeout the clock just became their greatest enemy really the clock the clock rim i can smash a clock that's not a great enemy we're not talking about waking up in the crack of noon we're talking about the mfl you moron Signals for a hurry up offense. Hey, man, what's the hurry up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls. One time when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. And they come to the line trying to tie this up with two points. And if they don't, things are going to get weird and desperate on this sideline. And they run it in for two points. I would have thought you had that muscles to move like that. Or a brain or a nervous system, but I see your point, Bricks. They need a good return here to set up the offense. A one-legged girl baboon could have kicked that ball farther. Yeah, that's the first time I heard you compliment your wife, Bricks. <laughs> and it's first and ten. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. But that means he can wrap up the other half. And he finds open space, is running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. We're at the end of the fourth quarter, and the score is tied, and that means overtime. It's a brand new game now. There's more blood on the field than players at this point, Bricks. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Here comes the kickoff. And it's first and ten. And that'll bring up second and one. And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. And that'll bring up third and one.
And it's first and ten. Six yard gain there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. And that'll be second down and four. Catch the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. And into the end zone for a touchdown! Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. With a devastating loss at home, the Lycans are licking their wounds. Looks like the werewolves are licking more than their wounds, Grim. Oh, that's gross. They battled hard, but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. and all the folks at Evil SN want to thank you for watching this presentation of the Mutant Football League. Today's game was brought to you by the Hexon Oil Corporation. We drill it, spill it, and kill it so you